Hello class, before we end class, I want to pass back your tests. Retakes will be made after break. Yay, I got an A+. I also got an A+. Oh no, I got an F. Excuse me? Yes, Rosie. There appears to be a mistake on this test. I studied really hard for this test. I don't see why I failed. That's no problem. You can retake the test after break. But can I take it today after school? No, you can't. You can either retake the test after break or keep the F. Ugh. Fine. That's the bell. Hope you have a good break, and I'll see you next year. Oh man, it's 6 a.m. I got to start getting dressed. All right, I'll wait till you're done using the restroom. You got everything before we leave. Yes, make sure you have your card. I also have mine. I guess this is goodbye before we see each other next year. Yeah. Ready to go out? Yes. Before I leave, I need to call my parents. Hello? Hi, Mom. Who is this? It's me, Caillou. I changed my voice to Joey. I'm getting older. Oh. Hi Caillou, we haven't seen you since August, are you coming home this Christmas? Yes, I'm actually heading out of my door, but don't worry, I'll be home soon. Oh good Caillou, can't wait to see you, everyone will be thrilled to see you. Bye Caillou. Bye mom. Well I guess I should be heading out. If we're going to collect our 10 grand, we need to figure out where he went. Crap, his computer is password protected. Um, try such heat this day. Nope. How about, this fish is cold, I want a refund. Boris, where are we're you? Collect our I 10 need grand. you to help me to with something. Where he went. Oh, hey, Doris. I was just watching some TV. Crap, his computer is password protected. I was protected. wondering um, if you could help me with decorations. Oh. Not right now. Nope. I'm watching TV. Maybe later. I Boris, I need you to show some compassion nope. around the but holidays. I, the I need you to do work, not stay there on Bingo. the sofa and watch TV. Yeah, yeah. Ha! Sure, Confirmed after I finish plane watching ticket this to Boca show. Raton. Ugh. Looks like we're going to Florida. Hey, Dad. I was wondering if we could play outside today. What are you watching, Dad? Is. We gotta get this to him my first. Favorite show. We're going to Florida but Dad, too. Can we still the play outside? Is no, but is there any chance there's time Dad, for the Dad, are you even listening to me? Harry Potter? Tony, what is Dad, the answer? you're really hurting my feelings. Yes. <laughs> Fine, I'll just go. Wait, what just happened? Oh well, probably nothing. Oh hey Cody. Cody, what's the matter? I'm upset that no one wants to play with me. Mom is too busy putting up decorations, and when I asked Dad if he could play with me, he ignored me and watched TV. Oh that's terrible, you poor thing. Don't worry Cody, we'll play with you. You will? Of course we will. Well, let's go. Hello everyone. This is it. 
I get to see my family in a long time. I miss everyone. Oh man, I'm hungry. I guess I could eat some breakfast. Cool, there is a Dunkin Donuts. I better go park my car. Hello, is anyone here? Hi, welcome to Dunkin Donuts. What would you like to get today? Would that be all, sir? Yes. Okay, your total will be $3.05. Okay. All right, here is your coffee and your donut. Thank you. Great, one more hour until I get home. Oh no. My car just died. Previously on Caillou's Christmas Special. Boris, are you going to help out? I need you to show compassion around the holidays. Ugh. Wow, 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 it's okay, wow. Cody. We'll play you with will? you. Of course we will. Oh no, the battery died. Is everyone dressed? We need to go to church soon, and Boris get up, and stop using your phone, we need to go out. Hug, where is everyone? We're, We're right, right here, here, Mom. Boris, how many times do I have to tell you, get up so we can go? Hug, fine, let's go kids, your father will catch up. Wait, what happened, did everyone already leave? Well, I better go catch them. Before we end this mess I just want to say hope you all have a Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays and New Year, and hope you get home soon and have a good night's sleep. Our closing hymn is number 523, Joy to the World, number 5, 2, 3. Man, what am I going to do? No one is here on the streets, because it's Not Christmas Eve and that it's very cold. I need to call my mom. Hello mom, I have bad news, my car broke down. Oh my gosh, are you alright, did you crash? I'm fine, only the car battery died and I can't find anyone else on the road who can help me. That's terrible, do you know where you might be or if there is a shop nearby? No, oh wait, I think I see somebody. I might have to call you back. Hey mister, do you think you can help me? 
My car battery died. Sure, we can help you. I'll tell my friend to pull over so we can give you a pump. I need you to turn left. Check to see if it works. All right. It works. Thank you. Glad we could help you. Boris, did you hear? Caillou's car broke down. I hope Caillou is okay. Boris, do you hear me? Yeah, yeah. Hey, this show is awesome. Ugh, you know what? What the? Doris, why did you do that? Don't you want Doris me? You have been extremely disrespectful to me and the family. 1. You didn't help me with decorations. 2. Cody cried when you ignored him when only he wanted to play with you. And 3. You wouldn't bother hearing that Caillou could be in danger. So what? That doesn't mean you should unplug the TV. I was watching that. Boris, I need you to think about what you just said to me. What else? What else? Fine. If you want to watch TV then go. But until you learn how to behave in this family, you're not allowed to sleep with me in the bedroom, sleep on the couch. Ugh fine, I don't need you to be happy. Finally I'm home. Oh wait, I hear someone coming. Santa, is that really you? Yes, it's me, the real Santa Claus, and I came here to tell you that you're the only one who can save Christmas. Wait, what do you mean I'm the only one that can save Christmas? I mean that your family is in danger of having a great Christmas. What do you mean? What happened when I was gone? Your mom Doris, got in a big argument with your dad Boris, and the kids will not speak nor play with their father for what he had done. What did Boris, I mean... My father do to the family. That's for you to decide. You see, Christmas is a time of peace and love, a time where family can get together, but because of your dad, it could ruin the Christmas spirit. Well, why can't you do that? I can't because I have to deliver more presents to the children in the world. I'm going to give you a Santa suit. It allows anyone wearing the suit to transport anywhere. It can transport you to people's dreams as well. You only have 30 minutes to get your dad to believe in Christmas. Otherwise it will be too late. The suit will teleport back to me. Now go, save your family. Let's go save Christmas. Is that cookies and milk? Wait a minute, what am I doing? I got to go to Boris's head. Alright, here goes nothing. Where am I? Am I dreaming? I guess I can do whatever I want. Well, who are you supposed to be? You look like my son Caillou. I can assure you, I'm not your son Caillou, but I am Santa Claus, and I'm here to treat you what the true meaning of Christmas is. The true meaning of Christmas? I already know what the true meaning of Christmas is, it's spending time with family and friends. Ah, correct, but that's not how you treated your family. How do you know this? Wait a minute this is a dream, so you're not real. But that doesn't mean you should forget and wake up. Before you do that, I need to show you some stuff. Follow me. Where are we? The real question is when are we, and we're in the past. I traveled back to show you how you acted like before. Now, watch. Don't worry, they can't see you. Boris, I need your help with something. Oh, 
Hey Doris, I was just watching some TV. I remember this. Doris yelled at me because I was watching TV. But do you know why she yelled at you? No, I don't remember. Well, let's watch. Not right now, maybe later. Ugh. So, you didn't want to help your wife out. I don't see how that's bad. I said I was going to do it later. Okay, but, how about this scene? Dad, can we play outside? Dad, you're hurting my feelings. Fine, I'll just go. What about that scene? It seemed as though, you didn't care what Cody had to say. Who just laughed, completely ignored him until he cried. I really loved that show. Alright Boris, I'm going to show you one last clip. That was Caillou on the phone, I hope he's okay. Boris, are you even listening to me? You know what? What was that for? You've been extremely disrespectful to me and my family, one you didn't help me with decorations, two you made Cody cry when he wanted to play with you and three Kai you could be in danger. So what? So what, Boris, I'm going to need you to think about what you just said to me, if you're not going to behave, then you'll no longer sleep with me in the bedroom, sleep on the couch. Fine, I don't need you to be happy. What about that scene? Yeah. She didn't have to turn the TV off. I need to show you what will happen, if you continue doing this. Looks normal. Ah, but look closely. I'm so glad, we can enjoy this dinner without your father. Yeah, it's too bad Caillou couldn't be with us. Don't worry Cody, he'll visit us someday. Wait a minute, where am I? Well... You continued to act like someone who didn't care and fortunately, Doris got tired of your behavior and she kicked you out of the house, and you became homeless. Oh no, what about Caillou? Well Caillou. Let's just say, Caillou loved you so much, but when he saw you were homeless, Caillou ran far away, he didn't want to speak to his family, and he didn't finish college. Here is a look. Excuse me sir, do you have any change? Oh I'm sorry, I don't have any change. Excuse me sir, do you have any change? No sorry, I don't. Wait up son. Excuse me sir, do you have any change? Oh man, why did I do this? I should have listened to Doris, now, I'm miserable, and I have no one who can help me. I was I could start over and tell Doris that I'm sorry for what I had done. Oh, please Santa I don't want this to happen to me and my family. How when I saw this? You know, it's never too late. When you wake up first impress Doris, and tell her you're sorry, she'll forgive you. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure, now you better wake up. Wake up Boris. Wake up Boris. Dad, wake up. Wow, that was only a dream. Whoa, what the? Hi Dad. Hi Caillou, you're back. Did anyone see you yet? No, not yet, I just got here. Great, I'll be right back. I have to fix my family's problems, so nice to see you. I'm glad I got to help him solve his problem. I guess now I can just hang out. Come on kids. Breakfast is ready. Oh hey Boris, now what do you want? Hey Doris, let's just say that you were right. I haven't been respectful to you, I have been ignoring you when you needed my help, you wanted my attention and I have not seen that. Get on with it Boris. Doris, I just want to say that, I'm extremely sorry, for having offended you, please Doris. I don't want to be homeless, and have Caillou move so far away. You know what Boris? Apology accepted. Of course, I won't kick you out of the house, and Caillou, will still be a part of our family. Where did you get this idea from? 
Oh, nowhere. That was just a dream. Well, how about we watch the kids open their presents? That sounds good. And I also have a surprise for you. Bring the kids as well to the living room. Oh my gosh, Caillou. I can't believe you're back. I thought that you weren't going to make it. Yay, Caillou, you're back. All right, everyone. I know you're all excited that Caillou is back, but how about you all open the presents? We even got you one, Caillou. Oh, thanks, Mom. Let's start with Caillou, since he's the oldest. Yay, I got a smart watch. Yay, I got an iPhone 8. Yay, I got a Samsung Galaxy S9. Yay, I got a Nintendo Switch. <laughs>